today we are looking at what I call S space. I will start with the song. What shall I render to Jehovah? For he has done so very much for me. What shall I render to Jehovah? For he has done so very much for me. Na -ra, na -ra, na -ra, na -ra Na re ke le mo Na ra na ra Na ra ye ke le Na re ke le mo <laughs> Of course, the recent event in the news is when you had the Belarusian authorities diverting a Ryanair flight that was from Greece and they forced it to you know, make a stopover. And inside that particular flight uh, was a reporter, Roman Protasevich, who was taken off the flight and arrested. Um, of course, these are part of the perils of journalism. But of course, the story, the plot then thickened. Because, of course, he was visibly afraid you know, when the flight was being diverted. I think he realized that. You know, these guys were actually going to get hold of him eventually, because that's what some of the passengers testified to. But after a few days, after he was apprehended and he was paraded in a press conference, and he had this to say, in fact, he recanted his dissident, his dissident views. And these are some of the quotes from the news conference in which he was paraded. I understand what kind of damage I've inflicted, not only on the state, but on the country today, I want to do everything to correct the situation. I'm not wearing a taser and I'm not being fed a truth serum. Uh, if you don't believe me, just say it. You know, he said he felt wonderful and that he was not under you know, any kind of pressure to say the thing that he was saying, <laughs> which is very interesting. Uh, but of course, Jesus is also coming in the air. Um, we cannot, I might not be able to say something very definite about what is going on in Belarus. Um, you know, what the conclusion of the matter will be. But the scripture is very clear. Mark 13, verse 26. Then they will see the Son of Man coming in the clouds with great power and glory. And then he will send his angels and gather together his elect from the four winds, from the farthest part of the earth to the farthest part of heaven. Mark 16, 27. For the Son of Man will come in his Father's glory with his angels, and then he will repay everyone according to what he has done. Of course, this is very close to the story, but it's not the same thing. The Lord is taking charge. He's going to come in the air and he's going to dish out you know, rewards and punishment. Uh, in the case of the Belarusian authority, you, know, you could see, see that the day of reckoning, even though some of us, because of my background, I have a soft spot for journalism, but the day of reckoning is actually coming. This is clearly attested to in scripture. You know, and you want to be on the right side of history when that day comes. You know, so you need to make the commitment to the Lord so that when the day comes, you know, you are you know, with the elect.